Hello, you're live with Nancy Kachingira on BBC World News. China has flown warplanes close to Taiwan as tension rises between Washington and Beijing. China warns the United States it will pay the price if U.S. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi visits Taiwan during her Asia trip. President Biden confirms the head of al-Qaeda, Ayman al-Zawahiri, has been killed by a U.S. drone strike in Kabul. He made videos, including the recent weeks, calling for his followers to attack the United States and our allies. Now, justice has been delivered, and this terrorist leader is no more. The first ship carrying Ukrainian grain is expected to arrive in Turkey on Tuesday night. The extraordinary story of how co-joined twins with fused brains were separated using virtual reality surgery. In the next half hour, we'll be hearing from our correspondents in Taiwan, Kabul and Kiev. Welcome and thank you for joining us. China has flown warplanes close to the island of Taiwan ahead of an expected visit by the Speaker of the U.S. House of Representatives, Nancy Pelosi. This is as part of her tour of Asia. There's no of official confirmation of this just yet, but some reports suggest that Mrs. Pelosi will arrive in Taiwan on Tuesday evening local time. Now, if she does, she'll be the highest ranking U.S. official to visit the island since 1997. Sources say she will meet with the Taiwanese president Tsai Ing-wen on Wednesday. Beijing is strongly warning against the visit. The White House said China may respond with military provocations, although experts say that armed conflict is unlikely. Taiwan is a self-ruled island, but claimed by China, which sees it as a breakaway province. Let's hear now from the Chinese foreign ministry. 立场和态度是十分明确的。